Hey everybody, D22 with you today. We're looking at Rumble's new updates here. So I just released the update where you can automatically upload videos from the actual app itself, whereas you needed to have two apps to download it before. So we're gonna show you the differences here. As you can see, the layout looks the same here where all your pages are. And this is the new upload or record section. So from the window that you can see here, you can record straight from the device here, but you have to make sure that the conditions are lit properly and that there's no obstructions because I tried recording it and it said recording finished with error. So you got to make sure that you have a good internet connection and that everything is set up properly and you'll just keep getting this error. So this is a new feature that they had in the Rumble camera app, but you don't have to have the two apps anymore. So this is just one thing that I was just playing around with, but you can also choose from your gallery of stuff, the videos here, and you can just pick a video and then just go through the timeline on the bottom here. You can trim your video by just sliding it and sliding the slider back and forth like that. And then you can trim the length and that way you can just get it however you want it. Now it's not like an inline editor, but it allows you to just trim the video at a desired length. And then you can just pick whatever you want from the gallery. And then we'll just pick this one, for example. And then we're just going to just play around with the timeline here. So once you have that, you can upload it. And then they have what's called a new thumbnail upload function. You can select from certain frames of the video in order to make that your thumbnail, or you can just make a custom thumbnail to upload as well. And you can do that on your Photoshop software or whatever you have on your phone. And then you can write your title. We'll just do like a test title here let's just type in just some stuff here like rumble new upload title something like that then you can write your description and you can also choose your channel to download it if you have more than one channel on here you can just pick the channel that has the most followers or whatever you have and then you just go to next and then you can just check the boxes and you can select the license and visibility so we're going to set it to private so that way if you want to see it that's fine then you can also select the license where it's just rumble only video management exclusive or excluding youtube personal use or rumble only so if your video is exclusive to rumble just select that but if you want to do it for something else like management exclusive rights you can pick that as well so this is all that you can do from the main Rumble app now. This update was probably done a while ago, but this video is just covering the updates that you see here. And then you can choose to schedule your upload so that way it uploads on that date and time. And then you can provide your local time. And then after that, you just press on the publish button. And then once that goes through, it uploads it and it publishes your video. So I'm just gonna set it to private. And then we're gonna press publish. And then it'll appear on this little prompt here on your channel screen. So that way it can show you how to upload. And to thumb up videos, the thumb down videos, you just press Press on the thumbs up and the thumbs down and then this setting's the same here you can also use the referral link to invite people to rumble so you can check me out on rumble on the description below there and then you can just click on the link and it'll take you straight there share everything there there you go and then after that it'll allow you to just go through the motions there so there you go and it also shows notifications and notifications are there so those are the new updates that i could think of in your settings here, it shows your notifications where it'll show money earned, background play, playback and feeds, uploads, user details. You can set the upload quality to full quality so it gets all of your video settings right. You can upload to Wi-Fi only. You can also change your details. And then you can also set your background play, which I have picture in picture because it's really nice because I don't have YouTube premium and I like that feature. So there you go. And you can also set it to dark mode by pressing on the top right there. And it shows a little moon on the top right and then it goes dark. That's really nice. I mean, they had that feature before, but I probably explained it in my last video, and then it shows your earnings there for all of that. So thank you very much for watching. Have a great day. We'll see you next time for another original video. Bye-bye for now.